Hey guys, BW Games here today, and welcome to the second episode of my uh, Chelsea Road to Glory, Building the Blues. So yeah, this is a Road to Glory completely surrounding Chelsea FC players, and if you did miss the first episode, then please do head down to the description where there will be a link to that first video. So uh, as you can see, here is the team that uh, we're going to be going into the first game with. We've got five Chelsea players in there in total. And the next player that we can unlock is Nathaniel Chalaba, uh, the centre midfielder. And uh, yeah, as you can see, we did put our first silver in the team last episode. That is Nathan Ake, who looks like a very decent defender. And we also added in last episode, right at the end, Kane and also Isaiah Brown, who are both going to be making their debuts in this first game. And on your screen now, as you can see, there are the points that we do get, where 50 points will unlock the next best Chelsea player. So yeah, as you can see, we've played three games, one, two, and lost one. So let's get right into the next game. So as you can see, if we manage to win two of our three games in this episode, then we will get promotion from Division 10. So here we go. We're up against yet another uh, what looks like a starter pack team. So yeah, we could cruise to victory here. All right, so here we go. I saw, I saw Brown immediately getting on the ball here. And can he get a debut goal? Very quickly into his debut, he cannot. And uh, as you can see, he's randomly quit in like the third minute. So I don't know what that's all about, but I assume it won't add anything to our, uh, our, yeah, it, it just, it's just discounted the game completely. I suppose it will show up on the players' records, but we'll just get straight into a second game. So here we go. We've now come up against Mendoza FC, who does have probably the strongest team we have faced so far, with Boney, Moses, uh, Henderson, Fraser Forster, and also that gold left winger as well. So yeah, he could be slightly more challenging than our first opponent would have been. Oh, and Isaiah Brown could be through here. He's only got the keeper to beat. Can he beat the keeper? Oh, and it's saved, I think, by the defender there. And can Ake hold off Boney? Oh, he puts good pressure on him to uh, prevent a lethal shot. Well, oh, Loftus-Cheek goes for one, and it almost was in the top corner there. Oh, and we could have an opportunity here. It's in the back of the net. Ruben Loftus-Cheek with the goal. He's just boy not making his debut, but we still get the goal, and we are now 1-0 up. And that is half time, guys. As you can see, we're level on shots and shots on target. I'm slightly ahead in possession, but apart from that, we're pretty similar. And, uh, yeah, we just goal ahead. Oh, and that's nice football from him. But our goalkeeper does manage to keep us in it. Now here we go with Lewis Baker. He slipped it through to Isaiah Brown. And the goalkeeper just manages to clear it. Christensen heads on to Baker well. And uh, Lewis Baker here could have another opportunity. He can slip it to Isaiah Brown for the debut goal. And Isaiah Brown puts it away emphatically to make it 2-0. When Isaiah Brown could be through again here. Isaiah Brown for his second goal of the game. He goes round the keeper and puts his straight into the post. I cannot believe he didn't finish that. Lewis Baker now manages to slip one through to Isaiah Brown, who gets tackled by our own player, but he's still through. And he does manage to scramble in a goal after a good pass from Lewis Baker, but then getting tackled by our own player. But he still manages to put it in and does sort of redeem himself for that horrible miss a couple of minutes ago. Oh, and they could have an opportunity here. It won't really make a difference. They do put it in. But we've still won the game. And that is the final whistle, guys. Um, what turned out to be quite a convincing victory in 3-1. I think we definitely deserve to get more than that. We were definitely all over him in the second half. In the first half, we were about even. But in the second half, we were absolutely all over him. So, yeah, as you can see, uh, the two goals 
for Isaiah Brown. Two debut goals mean 30 points. We then also have a 10-pointer from Loftus-Cheek, uh, taking it up to 40. Then add 50 for the win, and we have 90 points in the bag. And also adding the 15 that we had left over from last episode means that we do have 105 points in the bank, and so we can unlock the next two Chelsea players, who are Nathaniel Chalabar and the Beast, that is Kurt Zuma. And as you can see, guys, Lamisha Misonda, who we were supposed to get last episode, is still extinct. So we're still going to skip him out and uh, hope that he comes onto the market sometime soon. So as you can see, guys, there are no Chelsea Chalabar card kit. So we will pick up one of these Reading cards instead. So guys, unfortunately, at this point, I realised in while editing that the audio did cut out which is annoying, so at the moment you are hearing some post-commentary, but we will be back to live commentary after this game, because uh, I did start recording it again. But, as you can see, here's the team we're starting with, with Chalaba and Zuma making their debuts, and the rest of our team staying the same, except we've got a 4 2, -2, -2, -2 formation. And then there's his team, as you can see, it's pretty much a starter pack team, with three goals in there, and one silver as well. So I will just show you the goals for this game, as uh, it is post commentary but as you can see the first one here did come from Isaiah Brown uh, banging it into the near post and into the back of the net we then also did get the second goal this time Loftus-Cheek managed to set up Isaiah Brown who could then set up Lewis Baker who slammed it into the top right corner of his left boot and we then also as you will see did manage to get the third goal with Moreno running down the right, getting it into the man of the moment, Isaiah Brown, who got his second goal of the game. And as you can see then, he did decide it would be a good idea to just stop playing completely. So I decided I wasn't going to exploit this and get a load of goals because that, that's not really the idea of the series. But uh, what I'd do is I'd take this as a rage quit and I just wouldn't exploit it. So as you'll hear now, we are moving back to live commentary for after the game. And uh, bear in mind, live BW does not know that past BW was just here. So, yeah. So there we go, guys. That is full time. And uh, yeah, you won't have saw any more highlights after me telling you that the, the player that I was playing against did quit. But that is full time, guys, and as you can see, we did kind of dominate it. it kind of ruined the game that he didn't play after I scored my th third goal. But yeah, that's just how it goes. I guess we are going to take it as a rage quit, because that's essentially what it was. So there are the rules on your screen right now. As you can see, uh, for every goal we score, we do get 10 points, and we did score three goals. No debut goals, but three goals gets us 30 points. The win then gets us 50 points, taking it up to 80, uh, plus the five that we did have a left over from last time is 85. And then for the title, we get 120 points, taking our total up to 205 points, meaning we can unlock the next four players and still have points left there it is guys as you can see we did win the title in five games one more than the possible four that we could have won it in all right guys so uh unfortunately post bw is back again uh now when i was looking through the clips i realized that because basically in the next game my computer ran out of battery halfway through the game which was completely my fault and so when i plugged it back in I just I thought that the recording had still finished, but when I came to edit again, I was trying to add the clip in. It wasn't there, and so basically, your next your the next clip you'll see is me after the game thinking that I just missed one goal when actually I missed the entire game. I also missed the players we added in. Those four were all gold. They were Mikel, uh, Salah. Um, Schwarzer and also the first Asper Equator card. So I'm so sorry about the completely shambolic nature of today's episode, guys. Uh, I would re record it if I could, but obviously that would just mess up all the leagues and stuff. So yeah, I have to apologize. And um, when you join the clip, it is 3 2 to him, and you'll see what happens in the rest of the game. And hopefully we can get it back on track next episode. So yeah, I'm very sorry, guys. Alright guys, so what just happened is my my uh, 
capture my game capture basically just stopped recording after the goal and uh, so then I was trying to sort that out and while I was doing that my TV was turned off because it needs to be plugged into game capture and he scored again and now he scored another one and it looks like this is going to be a loss when I definitely didn't deserve it so yeah sorry about that guys but that's just how it goes I guess and Salah does two he could get us a goal here but can't finish it Yeah, and they've scored again. Uh, Martin's just going around our defender. And yeah, so I don't think that mistake would have actually made a difference anyway because they've scored two more goals after that. But yeah, still pretty disheartening. And that is it. That is full time, guys. A disappointing result for the first game of Division 9. But we did manage to get 20 points on the board, which will take our total for next episode, uh, for the start of next episode, up to 25 points. Uh, meaning that it will be very easy to unlock a player in our first game. As you can see, Martin's completely tore us to pieces. He scored all five of their goals in their 5-2 win. So yeah, guys, I apologise again for those shambles. You can see the team we did start with there. Um, but I'm not even going to ask for likes because today's video just wasn't really up to par. But, yeah, hopefully next episode we can get it back on track and get some more points on the board to add to the 25 we take to it. So I'll see you then.